What is going on guys? Tonight is the night that Mewtwo was released to the world. There's a lot of stuff going on right now and the Mewtwo drama, that can be saved for a lot of other videos, but right now there is an extremely peculiar thing that's being discovered right now on Reddit. Um, I apologize if I'm not exactly going to be too precise when reporting this stuff, but I am really tired right now. The night was a train wreck because of my stream fucked up. Anyways, on Reddit, there was a post which was made by somebody who does seem to have a lot of reputation in the Reddit community in terms of the Smash Brothers stuff, talking about the Smash update that happened. Now, if you're not aware yourself, an update was released for Smash 3DS and Wii U tonight, which added the DLC shop in the 3DS version and the new patches for all the characters in the game and also adding Mewtwo in the game if you have the download code. So, because all this stuff was added to the game tonight, there's a lot more files that are on the game now, and someone managed to dump those files. And this person is Shiny Quagsire 23 Now, looking at this person's profile, they have a whole lot of Reddit gold and karma and whatnot. So it means something, not everything, but it means something. I was informed by Duncan Needy that this guy is associated with someone who did manage to um, dump the entire game file before. So would they really put their reputation on the line like that? I don't know. Something that was dumped from the um, download that happened today for the both games, it... <sighs> Alright, let's just read through this. Okay, so I got the latest update decrypted, and I think I have some news which might be interesting. First things first, new sounds. In the blah 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 folder, we have a slew of new sounds and some old ones from prior updates since each update overrides the other. The list is a couple of these sounds right here. Now, the ones that you have to pay attention to are Mewtwo, Ryu, Lucas, and Roy. Lucas, Ryu, Mewtwo, and Roy. All right, so now, obviously the biggest sticklers are Ryu, Mewtwo, Roy, and Lucas. Not sure who Ryu is, which is a little bit weird. I'll get into this later on. I'm not sure who Ryu is, although if anyone does know, please tell. However, Roy most intrigued me. Did they say they'd update the Koopa Kid sound for some reason, or is there more? Now, if you're unaware, which you probably should not be, um, Roy is actually an alternate costume for Bowser Jr. Or is there more? So when he said, does Roy have a new victory theme? He was obviously, you know, referencing Roy Bowser Jr. So I converted the four sounds which stuck out the most to me. So this one is the one for Ryu. Um, then there's one for Ryu again. Then there's Lucas and Roy. So there's two for Ryu for some reason. Um, let's take a look. So now most of these are victory screens. All but the first Ryu sound file, which seems to be a new stage. Now here's the kicker. Roy's victory theme is from the Fire Emblem victory theme. So if we take a look at Roy's theme right here, we're actually going to open it. Let's just close this and just download it. So let's see what the Roy victory theme sounds like. Oh, whoops. I should have put my headphones in. See, I'm definitely tired. Um, so, I mean, it's pretty obvious. This is the Fire Emblem Victory game, which means that the Roy, which is referenced in this download DLC dump from the game's files, is Roy from Fire Emblem, which basically means that Roy is most likely going to be making a return. The one that really kicks a lot of people out of the window, though, is the fact that Ryu is here as well, too. Let's take a look at his themes. Let's go ahead and download this. Download. So maybe that's like a victory screen or something like that. But either way, reuse themes are in this game. And let's take a look at the other one. Was this the one that we just heard? I'm not 100% sure. Let's just download one more time. This one's actually a bit longer. Did I just get an email? Did I just get my Mewtwo code? Um, no, not yet. <laughs> I'm waiting anxiously for that shit. So now let's take a look at what this theme is. Okay, anyways. So, from this information that we have here, and considering that the person who made, who made this thread does seem to have some kind of reputation, it seems like there may just be some weight to Ryu and Roy being inside of Smash Bros. 3DS and Wii U. 
it's one hell of a stretch. And to be honest with you, I still don't believe it myself, even considering that there may be reputation on the line, but it just seems really unpractical to me. Um, Sakurai did mention at some point within the development of one Smash Brothers game that he wasn't really keen to getting other characters from fighting games into his as much. So it doesn't really seem too practical, but at the same time it does. Ryu could be a great fit for Super Smash Brothers 3DS and Wii U. And Roy making a return is just going to be great for a lot of people who wanted him to come back in some form or fashion. It's just a little bit strange that there will now be three clones of one character. Well, there will be basically two clones of one character. But I mean, then again, it's not it's not that bad. I mean, I, I feel as if Roy could definitely make his return in the game. And maybe Sakurai can give him a little bit of a different moveset as well, too. But this information is basically pointing to the fact that Roy and Ryu from Street Fighter are going to be in the game. Now, here's where my doubts come in. At some point, this guy said he did not know who Ryu was, and considering that he had heard the music already, <coughs> you mean to tell me this dude was dumping the files, heard them, and said to himself, okay, this one's named Ryu, he listened to the theme and still didn't know who it is? It's a little strange. I mean, I'm not exactly the left, the brightest light bulb when it comes to gaming characters and gaming knowledge and whatnot since I had so few consoles as a kid. But who the hell doesn't recognize Ryu from Street Fighter's theme? You know what I mean? It's a little bit strange. I'm doubting it because of that, but at the same time, we're not too sure. Um, we need to have a lot more confirmation here. As time goes on, I'm going to stick on Reddit and I'll let you guys know if this is proven fake or not because other people who do have dumping tools will be able to do just that and they'll confirm if this stuff is on the game or not. Either way, I will talk to you guys in the next one. Let me know what you think about this in the comments. Take care of yourselves and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.